woman who runs Hillsborough County's bus system is leaving for a new job. Good evening, everyone. I'm Paula Grohl. And I'm Laura Harris. Hart board members tell our Adam Weiner it's another sign that not investing in transportation is hurting the Bay Area. Just a month after reworking the routes for the entire Hart bus system, really well. CEO Catherine Egan found a new route for her career, leaving sunny Florida for Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Very few places have somebody like Catherine. Now, Mike Suarez and the rest of the Hart Board of Directors have to replace her. She is going to be sorely missed. We have a great team here now. But without her leadership, it's going to be very tough for us to navigate the next five years. In addition to a hefty pay raise, Catherine Egan gets in Pittsburgh, which she fought for but could never get here in Hillsborough County, a better funded public transportation system. Hillsborough's bus budget is tiny compared to similarly sized metro areas since it relies solely on property taxes. In an interview just last week with Action News, Egan said it's the reason so few people take the bus in Hillsborough. So it's not that transit is not attractive. It said an underfunded bus system has a hard time being competitive. That's just the reality of it. And even though Egan is credited with making the bus system more efficient, some Hart board members fear the small budget makes the CEO vacancy a less coveted position. We cannot be an effective economic engine for the rest of the west coast of Florida unless we have a significant investment in transportation. Egan was in Pennsylvania today for the announcement of her new job as CEO of the Pittsburgh area's Port Authority. Her last day with Hart will be January 5th. The board of directors will pick an interim director in December. In Hillsborough County, Adam Weiner, ABC Action News.